Hello everybody, Bill Thornton, SoCal Saber here. It is elimination game time. Are you ready for some action with History Maker Baseball? Today we will be playing Game 5 of the 1998 American League Division Series between Cleveland and Boston. In real life it ended in Game 4, but this is Game 5 in the replay, and that's where we are going. Okay, so let's get down to the field. We are back in Cleveland and see what's going on. Like I said, it is elimination. One of these teams will be advancing to the ALDS or champ ALCS, and the other will be going home. The umpires we got today on first base is Chuck Merriweather. He's a lenient and a questionable, semi questionable. Tom uh, Shida, Toshida is on second, respected. On third base is Rich Garcia, he's lenient and questionable, and Dale Scott behind the plate, and he's semi-respected. On the mound today, we have, for Cleveland, we have Dwight Gooden. He's semi-flash, semi-control, semi-dynamic, pretty good card. And leading off for Boston, I'll try to hold these cards up today so you can see a little bit more about the who the player is. Leading off for Boston is Darren Lewis. Playing center field today. Whoa, we got a 4-5-5 five, five right off the bat. 4-5-5. Five, five. Is he a flash? The, and the, the decider die says, yes, he is a flash. Struck him out. Here comes John Valentine, the gold glove third baseman. And we got a 2-3-6 over here. Is he DB controller dynamic at this point in time? Because of the decider, he is not. Is the pitcher batting? No, he's not. And this guy draws a walk. The only time with the good eye draws the walk. Hit the first base, runner of the game on base. That brings up Mo Vaughn, the first baseman. And we're going 4-4-6. Four, four, is he a star on the mound? And no, he is not a star on the mound. Is this guy a sad sack, utility, or patient? He is not any of those. And is a single to right field and an active runner steals. So we're going, we got a runner on first. Okay. Runners advance two bases on singles. So he singles to right. He's not going to be stealing because he's not advanced. And here goes Valentine over to third. So Cleveland or Boston. Threatening right here in the top of the first. Good, and we got to shut him down. Comes their shortstop, Nomar Garcia Parra. Last one was a big scoring game they played. 1 2 2. 1 2 2. Is he a workman? No, he is not a workman on the mound. Is this guy a champer or a whiffer? The decider die says, no, he is not this time. This is a line out the third. <clears throat> okay, L5, second out. That brings up my, the D.H. Stanley. And that's a one, two, three. Is he, is he both flash and fresh? Well, he is fresh. The side of die says he is not flash this time. And so we got to ground out the short. And we got that another one of those icon symbols. Nope, he's ground out the short, 6-3. And he gets out of that early jam. Okay, taking the mound for Boston is uh, Tim Wakefield. I want what the guys that started the second game with this one. As you can see, semi-workman, semi-flash, semi-control, semi-dynamic, stoic runner. We'll see how this works out. And leading off is their center fielder from Cleveland, Kenny Lofton, at the bottom of the first here. One, four, five. Is he a struggler on the mound? No, he's not. This is a ground ball to the first. We'll take a three unassisted. And here's the shortstop, Omar Visquel. Three, four, five. Is he an iron catcher? We're looking at the Boston's catchers. Decider die, he's semi-iron, but the decider says he's not right now. 
Is this guy got a good eye? No, he does not have a good eye. He struck him out, and we're going to go use the blues for the next one. Okay, and here comes David Justice. David's the DH today. One, four. Uh, we're doing uh, We always use the right red and blue. There's only two. Use the red and blue, Bill. One, four. Is it a cold batter? Well, yeah, he's cold because he hasn't done anything yet. You know, but it, what is he? What is Justice? Yeah, he, he's not cold, so, but he wasn't cold anyway. He struck him out. That's three. Wakefield does the job in the bottom of the first. Gooden back out there. Face Tim O'Leary. He's the hot, the designated hot batter today due to his efforts in his last game. Four, five, six. Is he patient? No, he is not patient. It is a fly out the center. And we're going to be going to purple. Team chemistry chart. Rolling two. I'll, I'll roll the decider dice too. Okay, we're going 33. 33 this is the the pitching team dissonance. Okay, the pitching team is Cleveland. No, they're saying no, they're not dissonance. Okay, otherwise it's a ground out the first. Then we're going to go one three. No, yeah, well, the one three it don't matter. Okay, and here's Veritech. Catching duties today. One, three, six over here is in an ace. No, it's not. Is he a whiffer or cold? He is cold. Struck him out. <clears throat> it's because nobody's he's cold because nobody's done anything. Okay. There we go. And that's three. The top of the second is over. Wakefield back over there, and here comes Manny Ramirez playing right field today for the Indians. Two, three, six. Is he DB, control, or dynamic? The decider says, says no, he is not either one. Okay, is the, is the pitcher batting? No, he's not, and he draws the walk. Here's Jim Tomey. First baseman. He is a designated cold batter based on his last game. Okay, we got one one five one one five. This guy is fresh, and we're going to pop pop out to second. Okay, run around first. One out. Travis Fryman. Two four five, two four five over here. Two four five, two four five. Is he a hero? Decider side says yes, he is. There's a base at the left. We got a run around. Let's see what we got. The runners advance one base on singles. All right, so he's going to first. First and second with one out here in the bottom of the second. And here comes Brian Giles. Always a tough out. Where did I say? Oh, there it is. All right. Okay, we got five, six, six. See, Wild? No, he's not. Is this a good eye? No, he's not a good eye. He struck him out, and we're going to blue. Two down. And there's Sandy Alomar. He's their hot batter from their last game. Going to blue. 22. Is the betting team dissonance? This is Cleveland. No, they're semi harmony. Okay, otherwise, it's a double. All right. We got a double by Elamar. He continues his hot bet. Okay, We're, this guy's going to score for sure. We got to check on the running for this one here. Okay, and that's a, a two base running. 
field of choice. I can runners advance one base on singles and two bases on doubles. And so he's going to third. Second and third now with two outs with one run in here in the bottom of the second. And here is David Bell. One, one, one. Is he an ace? No, he's not. Is this guy a scrapper? No, he is not. Oh, that is gone. A home run to left field. What does that asterisk sign mean? Or that exclamation mark? Can't even find. No. Oh. Oh, if it's the same the same arm. Okay, so he's he bats right, and he pit and he pitches right. So it is the same arm. So that is a three run shot. Wow. Three RBIs for him. And he hit a double, so he's got, and he got one RBI. Okay, with two down now and a bit blown up inning here. <clears throat> Tim Wakefield struggling now. Here's Kenny Lofton, top of the order for the second time. One, one, two. Is he flash? He is flash. Struck him out one batter too late. Four big runs, four to nothing. Gooden back on the mound, feeling a little bit good, but he knows he's got to stay tough. Here's uh, Mike Benjamin, the second baseman. One one four, one one four. He is fresh, ground out the short, six three. Pitchers are fresh through the first three innings, and then semi fresh for the next three. Darren Lewis. One four six, one four six over here. We're looking at the see flash. Decider die says no, he's not flash at this point. Is this guy a champion? No, he is not a champion. This is a ground out to second, four three. In Valentine. Walked his first time, got stranded at third. Oh, we're kind of looking at one six six now. Is he a workman or gilded? No. Is this guy a whiffer? No, he is not. That's a ground out to third. 5 3. That's the mound again. Gooden does his job. The defense does their job. We're going to the bottom of the third. Wakefield back out there. And they know they want to at least get a couple more innings on him. Hope he settles down, though. Here's Bisquell, the shortstop. For a second time up there. Look at this. Six six six. Is this an ace? No, he's not. Is this a sad guy sad sack? No, he is not. This is a deep dry glove. What does that symbol mean? If it's a gold outfielder, he has a chance to make go to glove micro chart. Okay, so how Don't know what fielder it is. How would I know what fielder it is? Okay. Anyway, we're going to uh, the deep drive charts. So we're going to the glove, I guess, because there is a gold outfielder out there. Okay, so we're going to the glove. <clears throat> and we're rolling one. Roll the decider die in case we need it. And it's a four. A glove. He leaps into the seats. Home run. Valentine gets on gets one, or Visquell. I thought it wasn't Visquell. What am I doing here, folks? Visquell grounded out. That was uh, Justice who hit it. Okay. One one two three. That was Visquell. We're down here with Cleveland back. The unlikely Vis. Got, them all, got myself all confused here now, gang. Hang, bear with me. Have a good laugh. Because <laughs> I do. I laugh at myself all the time. Sometimes I get frustrated. I don't. Anyway, it's 5 nothing now. 
We're going to be uh, looking at David Justice now, who struck out his first time. Three, five, six. Okay, is it the same? He's a lefty, and he's a righty. So no, it's not the same. Is this guy utility or sad sack? No, he is not. There's a single down the first baseline base hit. So Wakefield might be leaving this game pretty soon. Here's Manny Ramirez. One, two, six. This guy is fresh. It's a line out to second. L4. You wouldn't think he'd be fresh after all of that. But he's according to the game he is. Here's Jim Tomei. Jim popped out to second his first at bat. One, one, two. You see flash. Besider's eye says no, he's not. One, two. Is he sad sack? No sad sack. One, one, two. Check with the score. Oh, we got to do this one right here. We got a close play at first. They're going to the replay. They're going to the replay. One. That's a base hit off the off the glove, and it is a base hit. So he gets it, and he's going to go. Runners advance one base with two outs. Okay, so they continue to hit away here. And here is Travis Fryman. I don't know why we had to go to the score. I thought maybe he trapped, might have trapped it. That's what we're looking at. One, three, three. Okay, is this guy a slugger? He is a slugger. One, three, three. That's a home run to center. Travis Fryman, everybody's hitting him now. This is going to be all for Wakefield. Another three run shot. Cleveland is just pouring it on. All right, time out. Okay. So coming in the pitch for Boston now is Carlos Reyes. Semi star, semi flash, semi control, semi down dynamic. He will be an ace for the first batter since he's coming in the middle of the inning. And he'll be fresh for this inning. And if he pitches the second inning, he'll be semi fresh. So here we go. And he's facing Brian Giles with one out here. The bases are empty. And a ton of runs are in. Okay, 2 2 5. Is he a star? The cider die says, yes, he is a star, and it's a ground out to short. So, three. so he loses the ace quality now. And here's Alomar, who doubled and scored in his first time. He's their hot batter. Three, four, six. Is he eager? He is eager, and that's a fly out the center. And he gets him out of there. But not before they play four more runs. Eight nothing after three, folks. Uh, okay, Gooden back on the mound. So now Gooden is semi fresh. Uh, okay, because he's the starter in the next three innings. Okay, and he's facing Mo Vaughn. They're hoping to get a lot out of Gooden now that they got this big lead. Uh, one four six. One four six. Is he flash? He is. The decided die says yes. He is flash. Struck him out. Garcia Parra lined out the third his first time at bat. And we got uh, three, four, six. Three, four, six. Nothing on C. Eager. He is eager. So that's a fly out to center. Not waiting for the good pitches there. And here's Mike Stanley. Stanley. Round out his first time out. Got one three five over here. One three five. One three five. One three. And we're going to unusual drama on the blue. With the blue die. With the base is empty. Okay.
Okay, so we're going 3-3. We've got a strict umpire at third. No, we do not have a strict umpire at third. The umpire rules a fair ball, and that is a double for Stanley. Two down, runner on second. And that brings up O'Leary. Troy O'Leary. Come on, let's get this plunge in there going. Come on, guys. Two, three, four. Runner on base. Yeah, there is a runner on base, so we're going to plate drama now. Right here. 23 is the catcher iron. This is the uh, Cleveland catcher. Elmar is not iron. He reaches. He, grab, he grabs the errant pitch, and, we are, and it's a ball, and we're going to the yellow now. There is no yellow. And we're going back to the normal, I guess. Okay. All right, so still pitching to O'Leary. Okay, 4-5-5. Five, five. Is he patient? No, he is not patient. It's a fly out to center. And they waste that run on second base. Okay, we're going to the bottom of the fourth. Carlos Rails coming out for his second run inning. He's facing David Bell, who won downtown his first time up. One five five. Is he a home run king? No, he is not a home run king. And that's a fly out to center. Lofton, one four four. Is he flat, flat, flash? No, he is not flash. According to the decider die, this guy a hero. He is not a hero. And that's a ground out to short. Now they're finally able to shut him down that inning. They got to get their bats going. But I have seen comebacks in board games as big as these. All right, here's Good in the face of uh, Darren Bragg. Three, four, five. That's up here. Three, four, five. An iron catcher. Cleveland's catcher is not iron. This guy, a good eye. This guy is not a good eye. Struck him out. We're going to blue. Okay, and here's Veritech on the blue. 24. Is this a hot batter? Okay, now this is a Veritech. Veritech is not hot because he struck out his foot last time up there. Otherwise, this is a fly out the left. Okay, and this brings up Mike Benjamin. Two, two, three, two, 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 three. He's not wild. This is a slugger or utility. He is not a slugger or utility. And there's a base hit, an active steals. And he is not active. So there's a base hit for Benjamin. They've been getting guys on the last two innings, but they haven't done anything with him. They've been getting them on with two outs, too. That really hurts. And here's Darren Lewis, top of the order for the third time. Three, four, six. Nothing there. Is he eager? He is not eager. We got a base on balls, first and second. Tries to walk. Says we need a lot of runners. Everybody be watching for the good pitches to hit, and I'll be wasting in your bat. Okay, and here's John Valentine. Valentine's 0 for 1. He walked his first time. 1 3 6. Is it an ace? It is not an ace. He lost that. Is this a whiffer or cold? Oh, okay, we're whiffer or cold. No, he didn't strike out his last time. I don't do it if it's a strikeout. Um, infield drama. The rule's probably wrong, but that's what I do. It's cold if it's only a strikeout. 
hits it hot if it's a hit. All right, here's the infield round we got going here. One, three. This is the third baseman, Iron. This is uh, Cleveland's third baseman. No, he is not Iron. <clears throat> Routine ground out, five, three. And they're going to let Reyes go one more inning. This is the only paid one because he came in that one inning late. Okay. But he's not fresh or semi fresh now. He's just out here on his own. Okay. Carlos Reyes. Five, six, six. He is not wild. Has this guy got a good eye? No, he does not have a good eye. Struck him out and we're going to blue. Okay, and here comes a David Justice. David's one for two. We're on the blue chart. 44. Hunter steps out of the batter's box. Timeout. Then takes ball four. Four ball. Ball four. So this squirrel draws the walk. Down here. That was Vassell that just struck out. I keep, why am I not, I got my cards wrong. That was Justice that draws the walk. One out, one on, bottom of the fifth for Manny Ramirez. Manny's 0 for 1. He drew, walked and scored in the first time up. 1-5-5. Five, five. Is he a home run king? He is a home run king. Goodbye, deep center field. That is gone, Manny Ramirez. Another home run for these guys. Are you kidding me? Holy mackerel. What a blowout, folks. All right. Here we go. Two more RBIs. Reyes says, oh, wow. I got to get out of here after this inning. Dome. Two, three, four, two, three, four. Runners on base? No, there's not. Is this a hot batter? Two, three, four. It is a hot batter. So we're going to fence. Are you kidding me, right? All right. <clears throat> One. And he is a he is a slugger. The one, and there's a double. Yeah, that's the third guy in the row to get on, so now he's a semi-struggler. <clears throat> okay. If one more guy gets on, you're gone. Travis Fryman. We we're hoping to get you through the inning. 336. It's not Acer Dynamics. Is this guy sad sack utility or patient? He is not on them. There's a single to center. Let's check on this runner here. Runners advance two bases on any singular hit. So this guy is going to score. That's going to be Ryman with another RBI. His fourth. That's going to be all for Carlos Arreyes. Okay, Derek Lowe is now on the mound for Boston. Derek is a semi-flash, semi-control, semi-dynamic. All right, and he'll be an ace for the first batter. He's semi-fresh for the inning. No, fresh for the inning. Okay. And coming to the plate. Now, see, that was uh, Fryman that just hit that one. This is Brian Giles. Giles is double. He hasn't done anything this game. He says, I'm going to get in, there, in on this one, he says. One, three, five. Unusual result using the, the blue one again. Okay. With the bases, with no with runners on, with the runner on first, yes, with the runner on first, so we're using this one. 55. So the questionable umpire at third. He is questionable. The batter hits a single runner called out at third. All right. So, so we. 
He hits a single. This guy is thrown out at third. Okay, so that's two down. Still got a runner on for Alomar. Alomar, one for two. One, two, four. Control. Insider's eye says, yes, he does have control. So the ground out the short, 6-3. That is three outs. Yeah. Not before they score. Three more. 11 nothing. Can you believe this score? Can you believe it? All right, here we go. Boy, Gooden still out there on the mound, top of the sixth. This is his last semi-fresh inning. Mo Vaughn is the batter. One, four, five. Now the struggler is a ground out to first. Three unassisted. Garcia Parra on the Boston Bats are just dead. One, four, five. Is that the same number I just drew? Is a ground out to third, five, three. Well, it's the same number. I had the option, so I used, used the other ground out since he was a right hand hitter. Family. Five, five, six. It's not an ace. Is this guy a sad sack? No, he's not a sad sack. And there's a double the right field. Mm -hmm. Stanley gets a second double in a row. This is what they had last time he was out there. He was a, got a, hit a double with two outs, and they stranded him. There's Leary, who was their hot batter, is now made out twice, oh for two. Three, four, six. Is he eager? Decided I says he is. That's a fly out to center. Same thing he did last time. Oh, good and hangs in there. <clears throat> Derek Lowe. It's two thirds of an inning so far. So, but now he's semi fresh because he it, the, the whole it, inning counts. All right, and here's Bell. Two, five, six. Is he a struggler? No. Champion or patient? No, he is not. Infield drama. Fifty five. The first baseman iron. Boston's first baseman. I don't think so. No, he is not. Otherwise, a routine ground ball the first. So we're going to do 3 1. And here comes the top of the order, Lofton, for the fourth time. One four six. Is he flash? The sider's eye says yes. He is flash. Struck him out. <clears throat> Here's Viscwell. One for three. Struck out twice and homer. <clears throat> okay, two six six. Run around first. There is no run around first. So that don't count the leadoff batter? No, we don't count. This is a fly out to right, F9. The leadoff batter could be the leadoff guy or the leadoff guy in the inning. So he flied out to right. And it's the top of the seventh. Boston is running out of time. Good and back out there. No freshness or semi-freshness, not. Darren Bragg. Three, four, five. The iron catcher. Cleveland's catcher is not iron. Is this guy a good eye? No, he's not a good eye. Struck him out. And we're going to blue. Four, five. The cold batter. Let's check this guy out. No, he's not a cold batter. Let's see what the back end of 
Is it a cold batter? No. Otherwise, it's a ground nut, the first one. Well, that doesn't, doesn't matter if it was cold or not, does it? Three unassisted to Rivera Tech. And we're going to Mike Benjamin. Mike's one for two so far this game. Five, five, six. It's not an ace. Is this guy sad sack? No, he's not a sad sack. There's a double to right for Benjamin. Here's another two outs double by Boston. So far, they've done it twice, and it stranded the guy twice. And here is Darren Lewis. Darren's 0 for 2 in a walk. 2, 3, 6. DB controller dynamic. The decider says he is DB con he is DB control. Wait a minute. DB control or dynamic. He is dynamic. Okay. Plate drama. Wait a minute. Let's go look at this again. Two three six. It's a ground out the to the pitcher. One three. Gooden's still cruising along here. Low, they're going to try to get another inning out of him. This is in their face of David Justice. One, two, six. Is he fresh? No, he is not fresh. Is this guy a sad sack? No, he's not a sad sack. And there's a single pass second. That's going to be all for low. We're going to be going to blue. Now we'll keep him until after this blue roll here. Manny Ramirez. Manny's homer at two RBIs. We're doing one three. Is he cold? No, he is not cold. The batter flies out to shallow center. Oh, cold pitcher. Wait a minute. One three, a cold pitcher. No, he is not cold. Well, he is cold, though. Because the guy, the last guy, got a hit. So he, he is cold. All right. So this is a uh, a hanging pitch smacked in the center for by the batter for a single. Okay. Let's check the run on that one. And this was a. Uh, a one. Runners advance one base on hits, so we got runners on first and second. Timeout for a new pitcher. First and second, nobody out here in the seventh. And we have Jim Corsi on the mound. He's a semi ace, which he'll keep all the time. Uh, semi flash, semi control, semi dynamic, but he will be an ace for sure in the first batter and to be fresh for the first inning. Okay, so here we go. That was uh, that was Ramirez who just singled. So that brings up Jim Tomey, who's two for three. Two, five, six. Over here, struggler no. So is this guy a champion or patient? No, he is not. Infield drama with runners on first and second. One, three. So the third baseman, Iron. This is Boston's third baseman. I don't think he is. No, he's he's gold. All right. No. Otherwise, a routine ground out. Okay, so we're going to go to ground out. An outfielder gold. If it's infield on the infield or outfield, the play result is a chemistry reading. Use the chemistry mini chart for the next the next at bat. Yeah, it doesn't tell me ground up. All right, we'll use we'll use this mini chart here. And there was a a one. It's a double play on ground outs. All right, so we're gonna go uh, and we're gonna go six four three. 
DP. We're going to move him over to third, and we're going to, he's going to be out. So we now we have a runner on third with two outs, and we're going to be using the chemistry one for the next batter, who is uh, Travis Fryman. Travis is three for three with four RBIs, and it's a chemistry roll. 24. It's the betting team harmony. This is uh, Cleveland. The cider side says, yes, they are harmony. The batter connects on a bloop single. Okay. And we're doing it. So the run's going to score. So no, that's no problem. So here we got a bloop single here. This run scores. And another that's five RBIs for Fryman. That run's gonna be charged to low. Okay, and here we go. <clears throat> the next batter is Brian Giles. Single is last time up. Two three three over here we go. Two three three is ace or a star? He is ace. And ground out the short. Six three. The month before they got another run here. Twelve. Nothing. Boy, the Boston fans back in Boston that were sitting in the bars, they all turned the TVs off after that fifth inning. They said, forget it, season's over. Okay, here's Dwight Gooden back on the mound in the top of the eighth for Valentine. If we can get the Gooden, so at least he doesn't shut us out. One, three, three. Is this guy a slugger? He's gone. It is gone. And that is Valentine putting one in the seats for a solo home run to break up the shutout. All right, ready. Here comes Mo Vaughn. Two, three, six. See, DB controller dynamic. Cider side says, no, he is not. Two, three, six. Is he, is he a pitcher batting? No, he is not. And the guy draws a base on balls. And they just continue. The Boston pitching has just been, oh, this is Cleveland pitching. This is Dwight. He must be running out of gas here. There's Nomar Garcia Parra. One one three. Ace or dynamic. The dyn the says he is dynamic. And that's a ground out though first. We could, are we gonna turn it up? They are double plays on ground outs. So we're going three six three DP. And he's gonna be out. That's two down. <clears throat> and uh, Stanley. Four, five, six. Is he patient? Sider's eye says, no, he is not patient. It's a fly out the center. But they broke the shot up up here in the, in the eighth inning with a solo home run by John Valentine. Okay. Of course, he's back for his second inning of work. So he'll be semi-fresh. He's probably going to get the duties, he says, to the end. And he's facing Alomar. One, two, two. Is he a workman? No, he's not a workman. Is this guy a champ or a whiffer? He is neither. What am I doing? One, two, two. That's a line out the third, L5. And here's Bell, who is one for three, a big home run in his first at bat, a big three run shot to get this massacre going. Two, three, six. Okay, decided I says no, he's not on those. So the pitcher is not batting. Two, three, six, and he draws the walk. If we're gonna if gonna give it to us. We're gonna keep we're gonna keep pushing the runs in there. Okay. Here's Lofton. Three five six. 
same. Okay, so Lofton's batting left. And he's pitching right. No, it's not the same. Utility or sad sack? No, he's not the same. There's a single. All right, we got a single. And the runners advance two bases on any hit. So he's going to third. And they just keep pouring it on. Cleveland fans are drinking up those beers. They're cheering. They know they're going on to the American League Championship Series unless something crazy happens in this game. Here's Vesquel. Two, four, six. Does he have control? The side side says, no, he does not have control. Eager or sad sack? No, neither one of them. And so it's, what am I reading? Two, four, six. Yeah. It's a pop out to second. We're going to be going to the red chart. Two down. Player experience chart. And this is David Justice. 55. It's a full count. The batter steps out of the box. Timeout. Play resumes. Roll the decider day for a decider die for a strikeout or walk. And he walks around. Goes figures. All right. So we got now we got the bases loaded with two outs. And it's for Manny Ramirez, who already has two RBIs this game. One, four, five. Is he a struggler? No, he's not. This is a ground out to third. Five, three, and they're out of the inning. All right, here we go. Top of the ninth. Last chance for Boston. Good. And we're trying to get this complete game here. So did let up that home run. We're in the shutout, but. He'll tell us he'll, the win's the win. Here's O'Leary. 2-4-5. 2-4-5. Is he a hero? No, he is not a hero. This is a pop-out to second. We're going to use the red. The player experience. And this one is um, Darren Bragg. 45. Is it a prospect batter? No, he's not. Otherwise, it's a hard infield grounder. Batter out at first. Active player. Runner says safe. He's not active, so he's out at first. So 5-3. We'll just do 5-3. All right, and here we go back to Veritech. Last batter, last chance to keep this alive. Three, four, four. Three, four, four. Not a prospect. Is he patient? No, he is not patient. There's a pop out to second. That is the ball game and the series. Timeout. I'm going to do a quick timeout and I'll be right back with you. Okay. So the series is over with a this thumping and Cleveland 12 to 1 in game five to win the series. Cleveland will be advancing. They'll be playing the winner of the Yankee Texas series when that resumes. I don't know when that will resume, but that's who they'll be playing next. Uh, Cleveland did win the series in, in real life, too, so that's apropos. But Boston only scored one run on their six hits, where Cleveland had 12 runs on 15 hits. They just destroyed the Boston pitchers today. So I hope you all had fun. That was a good one. <clears throat> that I mean, a good series going to five when in real life it only was four. It wasn't a good game. It was a good game for Boston or Cleveland, not for Boston. So anyway, put some of my remarks down there in that, in that remark section and hit the like button on your way out. So Cal Sabre saying, thank you very much. Take care of yourselves and stay safe.